the reading rush day four. Um, it is about 5.30 or so. I've been up for about an hour um, editing my day two vlog. Um, and it's just exporting now, so that should be uploaded here uh, in a little bit. Um, I'm actually thinking I'm going to go back to bed for a little bit. Um, I am off from work today, so um, I am going to just get as much reading done as possible. Um, I might pick up The Attic Tragedy, because that's only like 50 pages and I can read that in a sitting. Um, and then I'm just going to do some book watch some booktube videos and um, start editing my day three vlog so I don't have a lot of plans today just pretty much reading all day um, but I am disappointed with how the reading rush is going so far I feel like it happens every year I start really strong like Monday was really strong um, and then Tuesday was all right not as good as Monday and then like yesterday was just a disaster so I'm hoping to kind of redeem myself today and get a lot of reading done um, how are you guys doing how is your reading going um, how many challenges have you completed or how many books have you completed how many pages have you read um, love to chat about it with you guys um, I um, but I'd love to chat about it with you guys so let me know um, in the comments and I will check in with you guys a little later. Bye. So it is a little after 8.30. Um, I am finally like actually up. I've um, up for a little while but just watched a little bit of book two videos um, before I like get into my day. Um, I feel so much better than I did this morning. I think I was really lacking on sleep, so my extra couple hours that I got was really nice. But I'm gonna go ahead and uh, shower and then make some coffee and some a little bit of a little breakfast and then just power through reading. I want to try to get at least a few hours done um, this morning before like that lunchtime hits and um, it's like rainy and overcast outside, so it's like the perfect reading weather and I am really excited to like really get into the meat of Anna Kay um, and just spend my day reading and um, get my day three vlog up for you guys and get caught up on some booktube videos so uh, this day off couldn't have come at a better time. Um, I kind of just worked out with my hours that I had today off so um, it's perfect timing and it's the the boost that I need to get back on track for my reading. Um, I hope everyone's day four is going well, um, and I will see you guys a little later. Bye. Oh, that feeling after a nice shower, like fresh, clean, washed hair, um, is such a, such a nice feeling. I don't know if this is TMI or if you guys even care, but like, I only wash my hair like every three to four days. So it's always nice like when it's like freshly washed. Um, but I am going, um, I am going to make some coffee. Well, pour some coffee into a cup.
It's a little after 10.30. Um, I am gonna take a quick reading break um, because I wanna go uh, do some editing on my day three vlog and I feel like I've made pretty good progress. I am um, on page 75. So my goal is to make it, I think, I wanna make it like halfway through um, before. I, my goal, I think, is to like try to make it to the halfway point today, um, which I think is doable. We'll see. Um, but I'm really liking it. Um, it very much uh, gives me like Gossip Girl vibes, which I I've, I've been hearing that since I've like started looking at reviews and hearing about people's thoughts, and I totally get it. Like 100%. I completely understand where like that comes from. And it's kind of funny because like, I never read the Gossip Girl books, but I, I watched the TV show. And so it was like always these like, you know, mid 20 year olds playing the characters. And it's kind of weird because I picture that in my head. I know these characters are like 16, 17, 18 years old, but I picture them like so much older. And I think that just has to do with the fact that like watching Gossip Girl and like this being so similar, um, not like plot wise, just like, in like the way that the, the characters talk and their personalities and this like high society Manhattan like socialite life and these kids you know are rich and they're popular and, and just because their families are rich and they have like all this money and it's like you know who's dating who in high society kind of thing um but I am enjoying it so far. It's a lot of fun. It's definitely um, a nice change from what I'm used to. Um, and then I actually was able to participate in the surprise um, reading sprint hosted by uh, Ariel and Raylene. And um, they did like the journal activity, which I didn't buy the physical journal, but I did buy the digital one. So um, I have all these, the pages here. and. The activity was uh, the Mad Lib, so you had to use page 62 from your book to fill in this Mad Lib. I had to go a little bit outside of page 62 because I didn't have enough, um, <clears throat> but my Mad Lib ended up being Vronsky, shouted Anna. Why did you put the scarf on the snake? Now I can't cuddle. Um, it was kind of kind of cute, and it was fun to try to like find the words needed to fill it in, um, but I feel much better today than I did yesterday. I feel like Today is going to be a good day and it's gloomy outside. It's pouring down rain and I have the doors open and I'm just listening to the, the rain and I think that definitely helps because I it, love the rain. Um, but I am going to go take a quick break, uh, do some editing and maybe watch a couple of booktube videos and then come back and uh, do some more reading. But I will check in with you guys um, probably more towards lunch. So I'm probably gonna um, go do the editing and watch the food vlogs for an hour, hour and a half or so, and then come back on my lunch and um, and then come back around lunchtime and do some more reading. But I hope everyone's doing well, and uh, I will see you guys later. Bye. So it is uh, just about noon. Um, there is a sprint happening here in a few minutes from 12 to 1, and I'm gonna go ahead and participate in that and make more progress through Anna K. Um, I am liking it so far. I want to try to make it halfway through, um, which I think is doable, but we'll see. Um, I am absolutely loving today's weather. It's rainy and stormy and cloudy and I'm perfect. It's like perfect reading weather. So I am um, have a lot more motivation to read today than I did yesterday and be home. I'm not doing anything else today. I've got my puppy with me who, um, is super mopey because he hates the rain and um hates being wet and hates water unless he's drinking it but he and i are just gonna chill in bed for this hour and do some reading and then figure out um lunch and figure out lunch after the sprint um but i will check in with you guys once i've made more progress Bye. so it is about 1 15 um, I have made it to 100 pages in Anna K. Um, really enjoying it. Um, a lot of fun. Different than what I'm used to reading, but I am enjoying it. Um, I'm going to take a quick lunch break. I think I'm going to 
um, figure something out for lunch and uh, either watch an episode of Supernatural or watch a couple booktube videos. I haven't quite decided, but um, I just wanted to pop in with my progress. Um, I think I could probably realistically get another 100 pages read today at least. Um, I have a lot of actually ships in this that I wasn't expecting to have. Um, I really like Kimmy. She is kind of the one that seems like the most realistic of a 15 year old teenager. Um, her having a crush on somebody who is in love with somebody else and um, a guy who really likes her but she only likes as a friend. Um, I think my ships so far I think are got have got to be Kimmy and Dustin I think Kimmy and Dustin would make a really cute couple and then and um and then obviously Anna and Vronsky and um but I, I feel like that's probably where this book goes again I've never read Anna Karenina so I don't really know the plot and, and story-wise of the original um but but I feel like that's probably where this story goes is she's gonna end up falling for Vronsky, her and Vronsky, Anna and Vronsky are gonna get together, Kimmy's gonna be upset and so she's gonna turn towards Dustin and then her and Dustin are gonna get together. Um, you have uh, Steven and Lolly. Um, Lolly is Kimmy's older sister and Steven is Anna's older brother. Um, I don't know how I feel about them as a couple. I don't know if I like them as a couple or not, um, but I am really enjoying it so far. I am enjoying it. I hope everyone is enjoying what they are reading and um, I will check in with you guys uh, a little after lunch. Bye. Or so um, I want to pop in and let you guys know I am 150 pages in to Anna K and I'm really liking it. It's actually a much quicker pace than I anticipated, so that's good. Um, I do think realistically I could 
get done at least another 50 pages tonight. Um, I'm hoping for 100, but I'm actually going to go ahead and start editing my day three vlog. I got all my clips um, downloaded and I'm going to take a little bit of a break and get that edited and uploaded for you guys and then dive back into this hopefully in probably about an hour or so um, and read for about a half hour and do dinner. And then um, and there's the two sprints at seven and 10. So I'm gonna to try to participate in both of those so that I can um, get halfway through the book and then that way I can finish it tomorrow and uh, start something else. But I hope everyone's doing well and I will see you guys later. Bye. It is about 7.15. Um, my day three vlog is exporting right now. Um, and we just got some dinner. We, um, it's our one, like, bad meal of the week. We just got McDonald's. Uh, I'm going to eat and watch the last episode of season one of Supernatural while that's exporting. And then um, after that, I'm going to do some reading. Um, I'm just going to do, like, my own sprint from 9 to 10 and then do the reading sprint from 10 to 11 and um, get most of my reading done later tonight. I just need, I need, I just, um, I try not to let myself like burn out and if I'm not feeling it, not to force myself because I still want my reading to be fun even though we are trying to complete challenges and read as much as we, as we can. Um, I'm a firm believer in not forcing yourself to read if you're not feeling it and like at the end of the day, it's just about having fun and like being part of the community. So I need breaks in between sometimes. Um, but enough of me rambling. I'm going to eat and watch um, Supernatural and then check in with you guys uh, more when I start settling down to do some more reading. Hope you're well and I'll see you guys later. Bye. So it is at 9.30. I ended up watching an extra episode of Supernatural that I intended to, so I watched two instead of one. Um, and then I was going to start reading, but folklore just dropped. Oh my god. Realistically, is anybody doing any reading tonight? I, oh my god, I'm so excited. Okay, I am gonna settle in. Um, and I had it pre-saved on my Spotify because I can't purchase it yet because I have to wait till payday but I have like I have to listen to it so uh realistically reading is probably not gonna happen anymore tonight um because we're all diving into folklore and uh, um but here comes Taylor Swift coming in to save us all in 2020 um I am so excited to dive into this I love Taylor Swift. I am always been a fan. Lover is my favorite album of hers. So I'm really curious to see what I think about folklore. I wonder if it's gonna be better, if it's gonna hold top spot, but I am so excited to dive into this. So I am gonna settle in and um, start listening and, uh, and I am so excited to dive in. So I will check in with you guys later. Bye. So I finished for, so I just finished folklore. Wow. Um, <laughs> that was everything I wanted it to be and everything I expected it to be. Um, I have to think, I have to sleep on it. But I think it might be my favorite album. It's like just, it's so good. Um, the whole album just works so well. And it's like this whole story. And it's like folksy. And it's, it's so good. Um, I, yeah, it's so good. It's very short. It feels very short, but I I could listen to another like hour <laughs> of of the album. Um, but it's good. I like it. 
Um, I was going to stay up. I was going to stay up and try to get some reading done. Um, but I think I just, I need to digest what I just listened to. Um, so I'm going to go to bed. But I am going to wake up in the morning and, um, get some reading done. I don't know why my vlog is taking so long to export tonight, but, um, it should be done in the morning and then I can upload it. And then, um, uh, get some reading done in Anna K in the morning. Um, I don't have to be at work until 8.30 tomorrow. Um, so I have a little bit longer in the morning to get some reading done, but I hope everyone's day four went well. Um, have you listened to Folklore yet? If you are, I would love thoughts. Um, I know everyone on Twitter has been, like, gushing about it and sharing their thoughts, but I would love to talk to anyone who wants to talk about it in the comments. Um, and I will see you guys in the AM. Good night.